morning, Tuesday the 26th. I look kind of bummy, but it's just this flannel shirt that I pulled on. It's cold and windy and rainy this morning, and I got up and got showered and dressed, and then I threw the shirt on because it's just chilly in here. Anywho, um, staying in this morning, getting some work done, which is a good thing, and I just made breakfast, so I will show that to you now. I scrambled up three quarter cup egg beaters for one point with onion, bell pepper, and mushroom, and salt and pepper, and a single wedge of the Laughing Cow Queso Fresco cheese. So that's all tossed together, and that's one point. Sorry, two points, one for the egg beaters and one for the cheese. And then I spread it over a three-point bagel thin. I don't have any English muffins. I don't looked in the freezer, still can't find them. I have this open faced. I have a really bad habit of eating way too fast. So my two strategies for that are always to get a half portion and to eat as much as I can with a knife and a fork. And then it slows me down. I wait 10 minutes when I'm done. And if I'm still hungry, I figure out what I'm going to do. But I also have one point worth of pre-cooked bacon here. This is the H-E-B brand, but I think it's very similar to Hormel. And then I'm on my second cup of coffee, but one point. I've been trying out the sugar-free sweet Italian cream coffee made. I saw it recommended somewhere. And it's one point for three tablespoons, so it's pretty good. Um, not so sure about all the chemicals, but we'll see. And then, of course, a clementine for, or two clementines for zero points. So three, four, five for the sandwich part of it six for to add in the bacon and seven for the coffee so seven point breakfast i have a nine point lunch here i have a cup of the emily bites slow cooker white bean soup that is five points and then i have a four point grilled cheese two slices of the sarah lee delightful wheat bread those are one point each and a slice of the Kraft Deli Deluxe 2% American cheese. I do not like fat-free cheese. There's a lot of talk recently about how the Kraft Zero Fat American or cheese slices are zero points on the points, or on smart points. Ain't doing it. Ain't never happening for me. I just want to point that out. I would rather skip cheese than eat fat-free cheese. So I have a four-point sandwich here. I'm happily paying for the cheese points. And I have some grapes for zero points. And, of course, water in my glass. So nine points here. My husband and I are going out to eat fish tonight for dinner. So try to save up some points so I can maybe get a little sauce or something. I need to go through and look at the day. But I will definitely end up having a snack. I need to run an errand later this afternoon, so maybe around the time I run out the door. I'm having a latte on this cold, gray, wet day. So I have a third cup of milk for one point that I've steamed up here. I'm going to add it to my espresso and have a one point hot drink. I am going to go out in about 45 minutes and run into the store. I'm not looking forward to going out in this cold, icky, wet weather. That's winter life in the Gulf Coast. Those of you who have two feet of snow, we would never see such a thing, but we see some pretty gross, rainy, gray days. Um, so before I go, I'm going to have a three-point snack. A Dan and Light and Fit Greek yogurt, two points. One point worth of original fiber one, and then probably about a cup full of berries all mixed in here. Kind of a standard snack, but something that hopefully will keep me going until dinner. I think I'm going to have some grilled or blackened shrimp tonight for dinner, but I'm going to see what's on the board. The place we go for fish has a blackboard they put specials up on, so sometimes they have something pretty intriguing up there. But otherwise, I'll just get something grilled or blackened. But you will see that later. So for dinner, I ended up ordering the blackened shrimp. I think I overshot points estimates on some things and under on the other, so it all balances out. I counted the shrimp as four points. And then the grilled vegetables, I counted as zero, but I did add in three points for two teaspoons of extra virgin olive oil. 
And then the cheesy grits, I counted as four points. I did not eat this whole thing. I actually ate half of it and split it. So I believe that comes up to an 11 point dinner. I had already dipped into my weeklies by one. So I decided to have a goodie as well after we got home. I made these banana boats. So my banana is zero points. My semi-sweet chocolate chips is two points and then the creamy peanut butter is two points so a four point little dessert